Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of How to Crypto. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to download Rarible application on your Android. Now let's jump right into the video. Tap open your Play Store for your Android. Go to the search box right where it says search for apps and games and type in Rarible, R-A-R-I-B-L-E into the search box and search. You'll be able to see the application displayed in the search result. This one's the app that we are looking for. Tap the install button in green to begin the downloading process for Rarible NFT application. Rarible is a community-owned NFT space that lets you easily create, collect, and discover NFTs from thousands of talented creatives. The application is convenient for both creators and collectors and is user-friendly. Once the application is downloaded, tap on the open button to launch the app open. How to sign up for Rarible If you want to create an account or sign up for Rarible, then the first thing to do is open up a web browser. Once you do that, type in rarible.com and press enter. This will take you to the official website of Rarible. From the official homepage, click on the Create button at the top right hand corner in order to sign up for Rarible. You can choose one of the most suitable blockchain for your need in order to log in or sign up for your account. In my case, I'm going to choose this Ethereum option and click the Sign In button. Here, you can go ahead and sign in with Ethereum Wallet. In my case, I'm going to choose Sign In with MetaMask option. Now make sure that you're logged into your MetaMask account as well. If you're not, go ahead and enter your password in order to do so. Once you end up in this page over here, click the next button after selecting your account and now click on connect in order to connect Rarible with MetaMask. Click on both of these boxes to ensure that you're at least 13 years or older and to accept the Rarible's terms of service. Finally, click on the proceed button and that is how you can easily sign up for Rarible. You can now choose single or multiple from the display if you want to sell one collectible multiple times or a single time. Now simply go ahead and create a single item on Ethereum, choose one of the files and upload a file whether it is a PNG file, MP4 or MP3. You can put the item on a marketplace, fill in all of the rest of the information. Once you are done, click on create item at the bottom. Now simply follow the steps and that way you can easily create a single item on Rarible. How to log into Rarible using a desktop. If you want to log into Rarible, simply tap open a web browser. In the web address bar that pops up at the top, type in rarible.com and press enter. Once you end up in the official web page of Rarible, which looks like this, go and click on the sign in button at the upper right hand corner. This will take you to the sign in area. From this page, you can choose one of the available wallet providers in order to log into your account or create a new wallet. In my case, I already have a MetaMask wallet account. So let me click on sign in with MetaMask. Soon after you do that, simply go ahead and connect with MetaMask by clicking on the next button in the bottom right. Click on connect one more time and wait until the wallet gets connected. Soon after you do that, you've now been logged into Rarible.com quick and easy using MetaMask. How to add NFT on Rarible. Start off by opening up a web browser and get logged into your Rarible account. For example, this is my homepage for Rarible. Once you are inside, go and click on the create button at the upper right hand corner in order to create or add an NFT. Now choose the blockchain that is suitable for you and click on the sign in button for one of the blockchains over here or if you are already signed in, click on create. Choose whether your NFT will be single edition or multiple edition and give it a click. Now upload a file for your NFT. It can be a PNG, GIF, WEBP, MP4 or MP3. Simply click on choose file and upload a picture or any kind of a file from your library. Now scroll down and if you want to put it on the marketplace, enable this button right here. You can set it to fixed price, open for bids or timed auction. Now you can enter the price for one piece into the text box. Choose the collection for your item. You can choose the default one that is rareable or you can also create a new collection for yourself. Now right under you'll be able to see a button that says free minting. If you enable this button right here, buyers will pay gas fees for minting. On the next field, simply enter the name for your NFT. Let me just give in a random name over here. Now if you want to describe your NFT, go ahead and type in the description which will be helpful for making your NFT compelling for people to buy. 
Finally, click on the Create Item button in order to add a new NFT on your Rarible account. Now simply follow the steps over here and you'll be able to add an NFT on Rarible. How to change name on Rarible. First, make sure to open up a web browser and in the URL box at the top, type in rarible.com and press enter on your keyboard. Make sure that you're logged into your Rarible account if necessary. Once you're inside, go to the upper right hand corner and click on the circle and this will open up additional pop-up in the display click the settings button from the options and this will open up your account info right where it says display name type in your name that you'd like to change to and once you are done typing in your display name that you would like to change to, scroll all the way down and click on save settings. Soon after you do that, you'll be able to update your name or change your name on Rarible. How to change price on Rarible? If you want to change the reserve price of an NFT on Rarible, first open up your web browser and get logged into your Rarible.com account. Once you're logged in, go and click on my profile link at the top of the screen. All of your available NFTs will be displayed in this page. Click on the three dots right at the top of your NFT and click on change price. Here, simply go ahead and update your price. Remember that the next price you are trying to change must be less than the previous one. If you want to increase the price, you should cancel then create sell with a new price. Finally, click on the change price button if you want to confirm your action. And at the top right hand corner in the signature request, click on the sign button and that is how you can easily change the price of an NFT on Rarible.com. How to create NFT on Rarible. In order to create your first NFT on Rarible, go and click open your web browser and go to Rarible.com and you'll end up in this page over here. Make sure that you're logged into your account. Once you are, click on the create button at the top right hand corner from the Rarible homepage in order to get started. Now click on one of these suitable blockchain that you'd like to mint your NFT on and click on create. Now choose whether your NFT will be a single edition or multiple edition. Select single to create a one of a kind or multiple to create series of the same work. Once you make your selection, go ahead and upload your file. It can be a PNG file, GIF, WEBP, MP4 or MP3. Make sure to keep it under 100 MB size. Click on choose file and upload a file. I've chosen this file over here, which is a picture. Now simply scroll down and enter the price for your item. Scroll down and choose a collection for your NFTs. The collection is like a folder for your NFTs. You can choose the default folder or create your own by clicking on create. Go ahead and enter the information if you want to create a new collection and click on create collection. I'm going to choose this option right here. So once you do that, you can now go ahead and give your art a title and you can also give your item a compelling description so people can't resist buying it. Now finally, after you are done, click on create item at the bottom of the screen. You need to go ahead and click on the sign button in the upper right hand corner and that way you'll be able to create an NFT on Rarible. You can view your NFT by clicking on view NFT and there you go. How to connect Coinbase wallet to Rarible. Start off by opening up your web browser and in the web address bar type in rarible.com and press enter. You'll end up in the official website of rarible.com which looks like this. Click the sign in button in the upper right hand corner and you'll be able to see this kind of an interface. You can choose one of the available wallet providers in order to log into your account or create a new wallet. In today's video, since we are trying to connect Coinbase Wallet with Rarible, click on the Show More option from this page. You'll be able to see an option that says Coinbase. Give it a click and you can try the Coinbase Wallet extension by clicking on the Install button for your PC or you can scan this QR code displayed on the screen with the help of your Coinbase Wallet on your mobile phone. Now simply grab your mobile device and tap open Coinbase Wallet app from your app drawer and make sure that you're logged into your Coinbase Wallet app. Once you're logged in, go to the upper right hand corner where you can see the QR icon displayed. Give it a tap and you'll be able to open up your QR code reader. Now all you need to do is simply place this QR code reader on your computer screen right where your QR code is displayed just like this 
and wait for a few seconds. As you can see that there is a pop-up on your screen, you will need to click on both of these boxes that says I'm at least 13 years old and I accept the variable terms of service and finally click on proceed. Soon after you do that, you'll be able to connect Coinbase wallet with variable right away. How to remove from sale on variable first go and open up a web browser and type in variable.com in the url box and search login into the same wallet that you want to remove an nft from sale once you're logged in click on your profile icon at the top right click on activity from the options now click open your nft you'll be able to see an option on the right hand side that says remove from sale give it a click and click on the remove from sale option one more time in order to remove your nft from sale now confirm your transaction in order to remove your sale on rarible how to log out of rarible on a desktop now let's jump right into the video open up a web browser and get to the home screen of rarible once you're in from this home page if you want to log out of your rarible account you'll need to go find your profile icon located at the upper right hand corner give it a click and in the expanded menu pop up click on sign out soon after you do that you'll be logged out of your rarible account using your desktop to log in back again click the sign in button in the upper right hand corner and then choose one of the available wallet providers in order to log into your account let me click on sign in with metamask and there you go that is how you can quickly log out of your rarible account how to delete an nft on rarible open up a web browser to begin make sure that you are logged into your rarible account by typing in rarible.com into the url box and once you're inside the main home page, go and click on your profile icon at the top right. From the options, click on activity. Under my activity, open up your NFT you'd like to delete. Once you open up your NFT, click on the three dots appearing on the right hand side of the screen and now click on burn from the options you'll be asked to confirm to burn or delete your nft click on burn token and confirm the transaction from your wallet click the sign button and you'll be able to delete an nft from rarible that is how you'll be able to delete an nft on rarible i hope the tutorial was helpful to you if it was go ahead and give us a thumbs up i'll be back soon with more videos like this thank you for watching